This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Of all my back here with another episode of Thief 2014. In the last episode, we met with Basso after saving him in the last episode of the Keep, and despite some head wounds, he seemed to be fine. And then we took on some more of his jobs and explored the city to find them all and avoid a lot of the uh, reprobates that have been running around. It seems like the regular populace is not a fan of the Baron and his ways now, now that uh, the gloom is spreading and so forth and so on. But anyway, let's finish off a couple side missions before we go back to the plot about finding out more about Aaron at the asylum but uh, before I continue on we're in this one place with traps and it's preventing me from finishing it but we noticed back here a vase which I noticed before but I didn't really think much of about it but uh, if we destroy it there's a button behind it we push that that'll get us to that trap thing because I was wondering how you get over there I thought okay maybe there's a window on the other side we can get to but nope it's a uh, there's a uh, there's a yeah thing over here, so let's disrupt that, yeah. I mean, it didn't take me that long to find it, but it was a little annoying, I'll admit. Maybe I'm just not thinking like a thief, you know? Anyway, uh, let's see. What, anything else in here? Like some treasure? Probably. Ooh. What's this? Uh, let's see. Levax Debt Register. Levax Debt Debt Register. Ugh. Mole Kendrick, 1 Gold. E. Rothschild, 32. Birdie J. Pay Depths. Moss. Bo Boots. Malloy, 4. And Thomas Vinder for Depths Paid. Well, I don't know why we cared to know that, but all right. And there go those Depths being paid into my pocket. Yes, sir. And more of those Depths. Any of the Depths paid we, we now have. Ha uh ha. -huh. All right, anything else in here before we... Uh... Okay, now that we've turned off all the traps, I think I grabbed what was in there. I think... See, I had to reset it earlier, but uh, I think most of it should be grabbed. All right, then that's just that. And then we should be good to go, so. Yeah, I guess I'm just not thinking fourth dimensionally sometimes. Because I, you know, I know my vision told me it was in there, but I was thinking maybe I had to go around the building or something like that. Because there wasn't a load screen into this place, so maybe I had to. Or maybe shoot like an arrow through a window or something like that. But nope, it's all in the same isolated area, so. Oh well. Can't blame the game makers for that, I guess. I can only blame myself. That sh and then I had to grab that again. That should be it. Here. And so okay. is Eddie's That's what business. He'll be leaving town on the river soon enough. In a boat or under one. Oh, Gary, you're harsh, aren't you? Well, I mean, in this world it kind of makes sense. So It's not like Gary's ever shown himself to be like a true blue hero. He's done all this for money, so... Although he did save he did save one of his friends, so I don't know. I mean, it's not completely harsh, but I guess it, if you've uh, earned his uh, earned his trust, then that's I guess that's a completely different matter. So, all right, let's uh, go towards the other objective. It'd be faster to go. Yeah, it might be. Oh, let's see. oh yeah, I can't go this way because the switch is on the other side, so I'll have to. I'll have to run around so we'll have to I guess it'll just be easier just to go through this way yep yep come on get up there somehow yeah we'll have to go we'll have to go into danger, danger zone territory I'm going through the danger zone I have to be careful about see if they go if he turns around It's kind of annoying how to deal with all these people, you know. Maybe I could just knock his ass out. Save me some trouble. Nah, I'm just gonna knock your ass out. No one's gonna come this way anyway, so. And we steal some money from you. Huh. Toss your ass on. Toss your ass out! Did you scope it okay, out? Okay, so. How do I. Like you guessed. And the Baron's bust? Solid. Looks like some people are about to Gold. steal Worth some stuff, fortune, but uh even with Northcrest's sour face I have to drop down, maybe. This special security mechanism. Shit. Too risky. I'm calling the job off. Let some other thief hang for trying to steal the Baron's bust. Why do I feel like I can't not laugh at the fact that they're saying Baron's bust, you know what I mean? 
Anyway. Oh, now we can actually... No, that's not what I thought. Oh, there we go. Should be able to... Uh... Now, how do I get over there? Just, I don't see any... Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to get over there. Maybe I'm just uh, supposed to run and jump, maybe? That seems a bit, uh, a bit insane to do there. Maybe... Yeah, I don't really see any good spots to jump over there, really, unless there's like a... Like a platform I could unlock, but I don't think so. Yep. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> There goes Garrett. What did he do? He tried to... He, he, he slipped while uh, while falling on a roof. Although I bet that happened in real life to actual thieves who would like roof climb and stuff like that. Uh, with just, you'd just find dead bodies later on. So, Do I have to run all the way? Oh man, it dropped me back down here. That's... But anyway, we have to... Okay, we have to mark that again. Let's try this again without actually falling to our death. Let's see where... Okay, so... Let's drop down here and follow the way. Now you have to knock... Well, if the guy's not in my way, I'm not going to mess with knocking him out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, really? You saw me? Come on, man. Whatever. I'm, I'm getting out of here. Okay, well then how... Okay, you do a rope arrow, but what am I missing? There's got to be like a... Maybe like a... Like a... Oh, what's the word? Because I, you know, I think I remember being here last time and I had to like worry about like hitting a switch or something like that that I had to... Well, that just pushes that down, right? Or... Maybe that pushed the uh, the thing where I needed the rope air because I remember having to mess with this last time. Like I I had to I was missing like a rope air or something that, but I didn't have it at the time. Okay, so that's that. And I hit that button already. So what else am I missing? Did I already go in there? I think I did actually last time. Oops. Because yeah, I think I think when I was trying to figure out how to get over there, I think I messed with this too. But that's the problem with take when I take breaks in between recording sessions. Like uh, I'll forget like small little details instead of playing it back to back. I try to. I mean, I really do try to play this game like just straight back to back to like um, finish it as quickly as I can um, to to a moderate point. Let's see, I think. Oh, then there's that. That drops that. And then... See, there's a rope thing there. But I thought there was like a... But nothing happened when I pressed that button, right? Uh, oh, man, come on. I had this trouble last time. I, had to... I was trying to get up, and then I couldn't get up. I couldn't get out of here. There we go. Okay, let's see. Maybe press that button again? Because there was... Like, I'm trying to remember something that I had to do before that caused me to... that I thought I had a... caused like a bridge or something like that to form, but... It, maybe is that it? Is that... Well, that's another rope arrow thing, isn't it, though? Well, let me check over there. Let's see. I think that's another rope arrow, though. Do I really need multiple rope arrows to get over there? That seems a bit... That seems a bit odd. Wait, what? Who? Who? Really? Lay off. Uh... Huh, that's really annoying. That's... Really? 
I feel like maybe I have to maybe I have to go through that window maybe. So I do have to get another. Okay, where's that guy? He was running around earlier. I'm just gonna knock his ass out. Okay, I guess I'll do another rope arrow. Man, I'm gonna waste multiple ones at back to back. Well, I guess it's not a waste if it actually gets to a point or something like that, but still. And it doesn't even, as far as I know, they don't stay either. Like, as soon as you reset an area, too bad. Does this get me anything? Like, uh, well, okay, some treasure, but that's not... I really don't like, sometimes I really just don't like how the way this game's presented and, like, what directions you need to go and all that. Like, okay, there's... What does the map say? Maybe... It, hmm. But I don't remember seeing anything when I went the other, like, around. Okay, well, maybe I have to. I mean, that's that's the only thing I can think of, so... And I got... I used a rope arrow to get some... Okay, drop down. Drop down. Uh, won't let me just drop to the next floor. You can tell I'm getting, fr uh, I'm getting a little annoyed right now, so... Oh, I'm nuts. Dang it. Uh, piece of punk. What's, and that just uh, takes us... That part down there just takes us to... Uh, where does it take us to again? It, wasn't it, didn't it take us to the House of Blossoms or whatever it was? Yeah, you could redo the previous chapter if you wanted to, but I'm not going to do that. I could have swear there's like a button I could hit that allow that opened up this, you know, like opened up this trap door or something like that. Am I wrong? Maybe I'm wrong. Hmm. I don't know. Well, anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna see about maybe going around and see if that does anything. Like maybe I need to go into a building or something like that. Well. I am really not a big fan of this area. <laughs> yeah, see, when I climb, it just it separates me from that one. Like, I feel like I feel like there's supposed to be like a doorway or something. I'm supposed to get to find that spot. Man, this is but not a very productive like episode at all. Like, I'm kind of annoyed with myself. And I tried jumping off there, but I died. All right, I'm gonna take a quick, quick smattering break to uh, see if I can figure out where to go from here. So I'll be right back in just a sec. All right, we're back. I think I found it. It was uh, basically when you drop like down there, there's like an open door here you can go into. I don't know if I saw that earlier or I highlighted it, but anyway, I turned off the lights. There was a letter in there from an, from a, um, oh, what's the word, a uh, admirer. I think I still have the document here. Let me pop that up really quick. There it is. Polly's admirer's letter. My dear Polly, my darling Polly, we cannot be apart any longer. Your voice and gentle scent have ensnared me. When I am with you, summer shores beckon as they never before, and dreams of golden sunlight capture every waking moment. People say you will be mine, and mine alone. Your most dedicated customer, Reginald. Ugh, a little freaky. Yeah, stalkers, man. When they don't get their own type of love, man, they, uh, they try to find it wherever they can. And not in the right places either. Let's grab that. Yeah, it took me a bit of a minute to try and figure out where where I needed to go. I think you still need a rope arrow no matter what, but I think that's the Yeah, I don't god, like I know you have the focus and everything like that, but I swear, like, there's just so many instances in this game where it's just it's like a bad point and click adventure game where they don't little loose. Where they don't if you miss side takes care oh. of its own. Until it wants something, then all bets are off. But it's like if you miss that one little thing, you will be running around forever and trying to find that. You know, it's like the old point click adventure game that had you. If you miss this pixel, then you might you might play the whole game and and not finish it because of dead end scenario stuff like that. And I hate that. And true, maybe my eyesight isn't as good as it used to be, but still, I I feel like I looked around quite a bit before trying to figure it out, but. Uh, and it looks like she's been taken out by the society that bred her. A sad state of affairs, but what can you do? Looks like 
It's like her head was bashed in or something. If her killer know. was a South Quarter. Let's read this first before. Little Lucy's last letter. Nadine's trying to run uh, to off me. I knows it. She's always giving me the look and I and the necklace comfort loan me. You gotta tell, sell me a blade, Trav. I need to keep Nad Nadine off my neck. Please. LL. Replies written below. No deal. Last dock frock I sold to got killed with the knife she bought off me. You're on your own, Trav. Should have done it. And she would have gone for just... And she'd still have the necklace. Okay, so we need to figure out where the killers run off to, so we've got to be around here somewhere. Whoop. Oh yeah, i got to remember to heal myself off screen, because, uh, yeah, I took a couple of hits from random guards while trying to figure out where I was freaking trying to go to. Ugh. I said, I don't know if I can completely blame the game, but doesn't mean I'm slightly not annoyed by the name game either, so. Alright, we have to go in here. At least we're finishing a side quest a game. I swear, every time we do, we do like, exploring sections, I take forever to figure something out. Because I want to show everything on screen, like my my idea of like how I get to that. No, oh, she's still alive. No, yeah. well, whoever defending yourself, but uh, comfort take that. This should put the teeth back in her smile. Well, there's no conversation or anything. She's just sitting there crying, like because she stabbed a dude or something. I don't know. I guess we'll just leave him as is. This new watch, uh, the new watch laws in you. In this time of great difficulties, your duty, citizens of the city, to adhere to the laws of the Baron City Watch. You must do your part to keep our fair city alive. One, report theft. Thieves set, uh, set the life blood of industry, bringing disease, famine, and honest uh, to honest citizens. Whoops. Uh, two, adhere to curfew. Avoid the gloom, and the greatest is the greatest gift, and you can give our city in the, her days of want. Three, obey the watch! Attend all hangings and show your support for the men and women who protect it every day, us every day. Following these simple steps will ensure the continued prosperity of the city, and you, her beloved citizens, what truly great service you will be performing in these dark times. <coughs> yeah, sorry. Oof. Sneezes come up when they do. Alright, see if there's anything else we can nicker here before we... Get a few extra gold pieces, whatever. Make up for... But yeah, I guess we're not going to do anything about this laying dude here. We're just going to kind of just accept... Just let them accept our fate. Accept your fate? Anyway, let's uh, get this out of here. Okay. Let's see. Now where do we go? Because I don't think we have to turn in anything. I think we're pretty much good... To, Good as gravy, so. Alright, hopefully I don't, uh. Okay, let's. And yeah, I could, I could check those, like, windows, but I've already done that off screen. Basically, just random treasure. Okay, we'll see. We're gonna have to go around the long way where all the dudes are running around. Less time to worry about. Oh, did you have something on you? Well, if we grab them, we can. If they had anything on them, I automatically grab it. Nope. Then you're worthless! Thump. What's the fastest way? So I'll have to. Wait. Really? It says there's like a pathway here? But I. There is no pathway. Huh. This map is weird. Like, it shows like I should be able to go around or something like that, but I can't. Can we go around like that? No. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out how to get around this, so. Yeah, it's like showing I should be able to go this way, but I can't. And I don't think going through those windows would do. Actually, maybe, let's see. No, it might be. Maybe there's a, maybe there's a window around here that'll teleport me to the other side. Like like over here or something. Let's check this one out and see where this takes me to. If it has a loading screen, then we'll uh, then we're good as gold. Yep. Okay. That's how we're supposed to do it. Yeah. The traversing the city is a bit odd. I'll admit. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of it or not. Cause I think you would be because the whole ex you would be as I'm talking about you specifically. I'm talking about me. But what I would because you know I'm all about exploring, like especially in RPGs. But I don't know. It's a different feeling when I'm trying to. Uh, 
when I'm trying to record for stuff like this. I don't know why. Just, uh... Okay, good thing that guy wasn't doing anything for me, but, uh... But I don't know, but if I was playing this game on my own, I wouldn't be annoyed, but recording it and trying to trying to have something for why like someone else is going to be watching it, I definitely have a different sense of... Okay, I can't comment with that. You think I would, but... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh, but if I if I hit him, I'll uh, those people will cry out thief and all that. Okay, there's gotta be a. I'm gonna, am I gonna have to rope arrow it? I might. Well. Uh oh. Uh oh. Nuts. Ah, that's really annoying. Did you say that's my reckoning? Oh, this is... Oh, come on. Go away. Ugh. I'm already not in a good mood, folks. Give me... I want to get to my treasure. Faithless, show yourself. Best say I'm just going to knock his... There's no one around that way. Wait, what? Oh, come on. I was... Fine. I guess I'll get killed. I don't, I don't know. Fine. All right. Well, in the next episode of uh, of Thief 2014, we'll get to our next side quest, and hopefully, we'll finish those two off pretty close back to back, and then actually get on with the plot. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.